get there, take a photo and just prove that we've won. That means we won. That means we won. If you could get a billboard, millions of people would see it, what would you put on the billboard? And this is really going to hurt some people, but... So we did a hitchhiking challenge. Keith and Andrew were not able to come, so it was just the four of us. The routes start 6.30 a.m. No purchasing travel. Wellington the Cuba Street was our end goal. Hello. James, you know what? We're gonna win. It's 6.30. Should we go? Let's go. Oh, what? <laughs> Oh, shit. Let's go! Cool. Alright, it's 6.30, they've already run away. But the, the funny thing is, they forgot their marker. Right on the signs, <laughs> we have one. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go. The goal was to hitchhike all the way from Auckland to Wellington. Oh, this car's down the way though. Oh, yeah, alright. Perfect. What the fuck? No way! I'm just eating a pepper curry though. That'll do. Yeah. That'll do. We'll get out of open. That'll be awesome. Perfect. Whoa. If you're going south, would you be open to driving us? Oh, so bro. So you going? No, I'm not going south. I'm only going about 100 or two or three hundred yards down the road. No, That's all good. And it's a no, it's a no. Are you going to Wellington today? Uh, yeah. Uh, oh, okay. We t we'll tell you. Are you. If you're going Wellington. Huh? Aren't you? Uh, you Where are you going? Hey, no worries. How long ago did you start racing? Well, we left at 6.30. Yeah. <laughs> Still in Auckland. <awful, isn't> <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so we just uh, got dropped off in... Takanini. Uh, Takanini. And uh, yeah, what's well, cool guys. So much. Uh, just a little update, we're at the BP service station um, and all the cars here are heading down south so we're in a pretty good spot. So now we're going to basically approach some people and hope for the best. Right. Yeah. 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 Uh, are you going to one? No, no tower on that. Oh, like we're heading to Coromandel, man, so we're going like that yeah, way. Yeah. Oh, I'm on the truck. Oh, you're on the truck? Yeah. Okay, oh. all good. Yeah. Well, I'm not actually driving, but where you guys going? do, we're going to. Yeah. We're good. Thank you. No worries. Hit me on Facebook. Nice. Okay, so we just walked to our spot and suddenly someone pointed at us. So we think we kind of recognize the friend of James. Oh, brother! <laughs> What's going on, brother? Oh. What are you doing here? We are hitchhiking to Wellington. Oh, no, we're not going to Wellington, James. That's okay, we'll go. Where, where are you going? Not rock. We've got two spots. <laughs> So how are you feeling? Alright, so I mean, so far it's been pretty good. I have a feeling that we're going to be sitting around for a little bit. So we've decided to move spots just down past the roundabout. So most people coming past us now are going to Taupo, Rotorua, even Wellington. So I think we're going to hang out here for like half an hour. And then if nothing happens, we'll go back to the service station and start approaching people again. Excited about that. Yeah. Why'd they beep at us? Alright. 
We're about to see you go. Oh. <laughs> Alright, so we're now in the beautiful T-Rail with our nice signs going to Telpo and South and I'm just going to stand here on the road and try to get a ride to Telpo. Yeah. Wait, did he just stop? We're still here when I come back through, you come with me. Oh, oh really? Where, where are you going? Wellington. So no going. way! Really? That's where we're we trying to, to go get to Wellington. It. So you're trying to get from Telpo to Telpo, then you're going to go to Wellington. Well, yeah, that's the plan. I mean, our end goal is Wellington. I'm going most of the way. I think I'm um, just before the hills. <laughs> so it'll get you 90% now. That will be. That will be. What do you appreciate this. In terms of um, any, the whole, the billboard question, but any advice, what, what, what advice for would you... For young spinners? For young spinners, yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, they're, they're the only ones worth giving advice to, because I think the old ones are probably too set in their ways. Yeah. This is going to sound weird to all the young ones, but if you can stay celibate before you get married, if married is your goal, because what ends up happening is the more people you sleep with, the less chance the relationship's going to work, statistically, oh. and markedly so. Yep. I would say, if you're looking for a life partner, you know, you spend 13 years at school and then five years at university trying to pick out a career, yeah. and you spend five minutes looking for for a partner, uh. I don't like the word partner, but you know, I think it's a wife or a husband, you spend a bit more than five minutes and this is really going to hurt some people, but I say it with love. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Find someone f not from a broken home. Because once again, statistically, your marriage is much more likely to last. And you will get what the parents are. They used to say you'll get, look at the mother. Yeah. But I don't say look at the mother. I say look at the parents together. Do they love each other? Are they still together? Do they respect each other? I like and you'll it. be on a winner. I like it. Made it to Cuba Street and we're about to run. Run as fast as we can. Get there, take a photo and just prove that we've won. Because I doubt they're there. Uh, quick update. So we uh, made it to Cuba and we won. Now, the boys, we're all having dinner. So, What's up, brothers? You. We beat you. Do you think so? We beat you. Absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Right. Can, absolutely I, can, we, can I tell you guys a secret? What? We got here at 5.40. Yeah. So know. you got here like just before us. We got here an hour uh, before you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. What? And that wraps up the video. The hitchhiking challenge was such a good experience. We met so many nice and genuine people along the way. Everyone was so helpful. Everyone had their own story. And unfortunately, we couldn't really show you each individual story. But it was an amazing experience. And we say thank you to everyone that picked us up, to everyone that was involved. And yeah, stay tuned for the next video in two weeks time.